Butterfly gon' recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime road. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. That was crazy out there. Thomas Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the fire flies. When you start rapping like that. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc. etc. Don't let none of that get too far ahead of you. Click and blam, follow me on Instagram, Vod underscore fly. Tell your mama I said hi, I got my guy with me. Show time as Peter, nobody that knows bodies. Bow! Yeah, cheer, cheer, cheer. So uh let's get to it. Mm -hmm. You got to live and die in LA card going down this weekend uh, you got some battles on there you got a couple you know what I'm saying names on there that we don't really see often and you got some names on there that we would like to see mm -hmm. and you know there's some dope battles on here it's mm -hmm. not gonna be streamed live uh, shout out to KG the poet and everybody on the West Coast you know what I'm saying etc etc don't let them get too far ahead of you mm -hmm. uh, Dre Vicious versus Mr. Biscuit royalty versus bad news next versus Don Marino Jay the Nightwing versus Tink the Demon Emerson Kennedy versus Kid Chaos Chilla Jones versus Mike P. And last but not least, Danny Myers versus Rum Nitty 2. Two, two. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Um, overall, mm -hmm. it's a it's a good card, you know yeah. what I'm saying? It's cool. It's, it's got some it's got some battles on here that's gonna be that we're definitely gonna talk. It definitely got a battle of two on here that's gonna be talking. Oh yeah, we're gonna chop uh, We're gonna chop What you what you think, man? Pick one. What you wanna talk? Where you gonna start, man? First of all, what you think of the card overall, et cetera, et cetera. You know, how you doing? What's good? It's a what solid think? card. It's a solid card to live and die out in LA. I like the trailer. Thank you for dropping the trailer. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate that. It gave us a little bit of time to think about it and digest it. You know what I'm saying? Few battles on here, then I'm like, oh I, that battle. Didn't happen already, and then one battle actually did happen already. And then I kind of wanted to see a lot of these other names. It was about to be some questions like, "Where are these people?" Mm -hmm. And so now they are here. Uh, we could do the, we could just start from the bottom and go all the way to the top. You already know the bottom. Okay, uh, let's see. start at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Start from the bottom. Mm -hmm. Dre Vicious versus Mr. Biscuit. Mm -hmm. uh, Dre Vicious, West Coast dude. Mm -hmm. You know he's been battling it for quite some time. Uh, he's he's he, he he's he's feeling his way through. You know what I'm saying. He hasn't really made a splash on URL yet. Yeah. He does have some battles though. You know what I'm saying. Some West Coast joints. I think he battled Geechee before in a mm -hmm. one rounder. Uh, I was trying to remember the line, but I don't remember it. It was pretty good. Uh, he's he's got some other joints out there too. You know what I'm saying. He gets a lot of love on the West Coast, and uh, he's battling against Mr. Biscuit. Mr. Biscuit lyrically is really dope. You know what I'm saying. Like he 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 battled. He's had a couple battles. You know what I'm saying on URL. He hasn't really like got out there yet, mm -hmm. but both. Have you seen both? First yes. Of all? Yes. Okay. So what yes. you think? Uh, I like I like Dre Vicious. Um, Dre Vicious has been a, uh, he's been around for a while. I don't want to say a while like that, but I want to say he was kind of right after the the Luke Castro, like after that PG. Mm -hmm. That's when I started to hear about Dre Vicious on the West Coast, like right after Stewie Newton and mm -hmm. all of them. It was when the culmination of the West Coast that Dre Vicious was down that line. Mr. Biscuit came about about I want to say around last year. He was one of the Crucible guys. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mr. Biscuit has made an impact for me because he already had one of my favorite battles of the year last year, mm -hmm. and that was him versus uh, Young Grizz. Mm -hmm. One of my Slept on battles, but Mr. Biscuit, Mr. Biscuit, I wanted to see where he was coming with it. I think I got Mr. Biscuit, Mr. Biscuit in this one. I hate the name. Just listen hate to the thing. name. It's a terrible thing to say. Uh, <laughs> but lyrically, he's dope. Yeah. Uh, the marketing, you know what I'm saying? I've seen a couple of videos of his that he's like promoted and things mm -hmm. like that online, freestyles and you know in the car and shit yeah, like he's that. Nice. He's got to continue to build himself, got to continue to grow. Mm -hmm. But I will say this, it's good to see him on an actual card where he's going to get a chance to demonstrate and show what he could do. Yeah. Lyrically, he's ahead of Dre Vicious, so yeah. I could see him winning that battle 2-1. Yeah. Uh, royalty versus Bad News. Mm -hmm. Bad News, you know, he does his thing. Uh, he won in Midnight Madness. Mm -hmm. uh, he's battled some big names before. He's battled Tay Rock before. He's battled Chess, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? He's had some other pretty big battles. He's done his thing on Bullpen. And, you know, you got Royalty, West Coast. He's still finding his way through, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. This is crip, or whatever the case may be. Have you seen Have you seen both of them? Yes, I, of course I have. I'm, I'm, I'm a fan of this, man. You know what I'm saying? How you feel about it? I think uh, royalty, I had no idea who royalty was until I seen him 30 true foe on the right. So mm -hmm. now he's back on my radar, and I seen that he had a battle on, um, I believe it was Initiation. Mm -hmm. um, and I saw that battle. Um, 
uh, 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 I mean, like, uh, but uh, who's he going up against? Oh, uh, bad news. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. So the thing about bad news is bad news is highest ranking battle was of course one of his uh, uh, gun title homies. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So. With bad news, he was definitely killing it in the tournament as well, because I remember that. I remember judging those two. If I gotta go off experience and reading the room and reading uh, crowd control, the fact that it is on the west side, maybe royalty's gonna have a little bit of more of an edge. Mm -hmm. But I honestly think that bad news is more of a polished battler. He's more of a polished uh, performer. I think I got bad news in this one. I got royalty simply for the fact that bad news, while he's had a lot of battles, he hasn't done it on URL. You know what I'm saying? Like, he hasn't yeah. had those, like, wins and, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I check, I'll check in the app and yeah. see what, what, who he's battled on URL. It's right. I'll be honest, with you, I don't know. I'm be, I, I, I'll be honest with you, I don't even know if, uh, and this is not even on no hate shit, mm -hmm. I don't know if he has a, a win. Well, he's two and five mm -hmm. on the URL app, so he's taking mad battles on that. Yeah, like I said, he got five. Uh, he got seven. He had Chess. He had Kid Slade. Kid Slade got him. Mm -hmm. You know Kid what I'm saying? Him, he battled Ace Amin. Ace Amin got him. Yeah. Uh, battled Don Marino. Battled Swamp. You know what I'm saying? So he's had mad battles. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, polished. He's polished. This uh, one, like was ro was royalty only? I think royalty only got one battle, mm -hmm. and I think he got a loss. Mm. So. And not to mention, but you got you got, he got two battles. He's one and one. He got the Crucible okay. and he's got Deuce on um, Born Legacy Northwest. That's what it was. It was got Born it, Legacy. Got so so what happened was, even though there's more battles, there's more. There's, the accuracy is better on Royalty side because he's 50-50. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, you bad news been here a little bit more. He knows. I don't. I I, I I I can see the split decision. That one. That one. We can split that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got bad news 2 1. You got royalty 2 1. Next verse, Don Marino. Mm. Alright, uh, I'm gonna start with you. I'll let you. Both competitors need to smoke something. Mm -hmm. Both battlers have a lot to prove. Mm -hmm. Not something to prove, but a lot to prove. Next, gotta prove that he still belongs here. Mm -hmm. Next got to prove that he was no longer the plant and that this was just not a phase and maybe it's just it was a fluke that last battle uh, uh, the uh, the semifinals of that you know mm -hmm. that tournament yeah. you know what I'm saying he got a chip on his shoulder because he got to prove that he's nothing he, he got to remain indifferent and he also got to get away from the rum nitty style right mm -hmm. Don Marino needs to be respected. Mm -hmm. He gotta get that respect on that stage. Mm -hmm. He gotta get that respect on the URL stage, mm -hmm. cause they don't be feeling Don like that. Mm -hmm. They don't. I, they don't. I'ma keep saying they, cause it ain't all hate from on both sides. Both of them gotta smoke something. Mm -hmm. This battle for me can either go either way. Yeah. Cause it's it's it, to me. I don't have a pick for this one. Mainly because I really want to see if this battle was going to even live up to the the other battles on the card. Could it be a sneak? Could it be a sneak battle of the night? Because both of them come prepared. We ain't heard from both of them in a minute. No, it's not going to. Okay, but I'm I'm trying to have some hope here. I'm trying to, but this battle can go either way. It's not. You tried. <laughs> I uh, did. Best of luck to both MCs. That it's like kill it's like it's like uh, you know what I'm saying. It's one of them things where. Both of them need to update their resume as far as like on URL. Mm -hmm. It would be a good, it's a it's a good going into it. It's Don Marino's battle to lose because yeah. he's been on URL longer. He's had bigger names. He's been on bigger stages, and you know what I'm saying. The talent level mm -hmm. that he's faced is above next talent level. You know what I'm yes. saying? And next has got to he's got to show something. He's got to show he belongs. Like you said, mm -hmm. don't want to spend too much time on it because you know you you pretty much made good expect. But wait, I want to get to the motherfucker like, next. Mm -hmm. Next. Mm -hmm. Next. Jay the Nightwing versus Tink the Demon. Mm. Mm. Whoa. Mm. I went to the moon and let her howl out. Mm -hmm. Then I picked up and dialed the devil on the phone that don't dial out. Ooh, my boy Tink the Demon. I like Tink the Demon at times, I'm not gonna hold you. His back, that two on two that he had with Danny Myers. Mm -hmm. Versus Ace I mean the Swamp, that was probably some of his best work. Yo, yeah. wow, he gets really crazy. Um, he's facing against Jada Nightwing. 
one of one of mm-hmm. the better rising new stars. You know, he's had his hits. He's done great. He's he's, he's had tougher battles. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I could like I could go on and talk about Jaden A. Wing all day. I really love what Jaden A. Wing does. That slow flow that they got Tink. You mm-hmm. better say the right thing. Mm-hmm. They flew you all the way out here on the west to have a date with the Nightwing. Let's get right, King. You been pussy all your life. Like that, that pockets of flows yep. that he could just yep. jump into. Yep. Like he could walk. It's like walking someone to the cliff, mm-hmm. then shooting them in the head and throwing them <laughs> off. It. You gonna kill me anyway? Why you shoot me? Why? Why you shoot me? You gonna kill me anyway? You gonna throw me off the cliff anyway? You could have walked me to the cliff and told me to jump. I would have jumped. Fuck it. You gonna shoot me anyway? And then throw me off. I love the slow flow. Tink the demon. Uh, he's still, he, you know, he got out not too long ago. Mm-hmm. He's been finding himself again. Mm-hmm. Uh, he's had a couple battles here and there. But Jaden Nightwing is one of them ones where asking me going into it, I got Jaden Nightwing winning. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Like, Jaden Nightwing, he covers all bases. Only thing that ca- that stops Jaden Nightwing is himself at times. Stumbling and cho- choking and still. There we go. That's the only thing that stops him. Mm-hmm. Other than that, like, if, he, if you look at Jaden Nightwing's resume, especially on URL, mm-hmm. Any battles that he either didn't win or had it close, Go ahead. he choked in. Go ahead. You know yep. He stumbled mm-hmm. and choked. Mm-hmm. But if he gets, if he got through, and I don't want to give him the if factor, if, if that's not, I'm not there with him yet. But I feel like versus uh, Tink the Demon, this is a gift wrap battle that he should, he should win. But uh, should and does always doesn't happen. How do you feel about it? Pretty much it, the, the 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 nail on the head, you know what I'm saying? When it comes to both of them, except for I'll take your mother and I'll smother you and your brother inside of the little baby cover, and you gotta throw that yeah. in there. And, yeah, and it's it's fine when they do that. He said, "Tink, mm-hmm. let me think." Every time I gotta get inside of the bag, you always make me sink. It's like. It, you gotta do it with the, it's the, you gotta have it right. But the thing I also enjoy is y'all gonna need some space. I love him it's versus. Two big motherfuckers. <laughs> I love him versus Kid Chaos. Though. Ooh, stop playing. Because uh, you know the obsolete. And then you say, even my though my God. obsolete. Oh. He said, but even though that line itself was with obsolete, obsolete, it's fine. It's cool. I remember, I remember these things, you know what I'm saying? Because I remember, because here's the thing. He not even gonna remember that it happened. Mm-hmm. I gotta remind him that he did it. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? That's the that's the type of style that Jaden Nightwing has. But with Tink the Demon, Tink the Demon has to come up under that Danny shadow. Because mm-hmm. it's like, oh well, you was only good when you was with Danny. Mm-hmm. Okay, well let's see and what else. Another thing is Jaden Nightwing currently is ranked number five on the URL app. He's 13 and three. That is an amazing record. He doesn't lose many battles. Like I said, Does any battle. Any one of the three battles, I don't have to look through all 13 mm-hmm. right now, but any one of the three battles that people have him with an L in, I guarantee you it's, it's a It's because he choked it. Yeah, it's because he messed up. Mm-hmm. But still, it's a it's a thing that does happen. But you know what we have, but uh, but you know what's uh, the difference between now and uh, then and now? Wow. When the last time you heard from Jaden Nightwing, other than the battle with Frank, right? Yeah. It's like, what, last month? And I didn't even see that. Exactly. So. Well, I didn't. Yeah, I watched it. it oh, Frack beat the hell out. Anyway, um, no, no. I'm sorry. It wasn't Frack. It wasn't Frack. It wasn't Frack. It was uh, mm, Jada Nightwing just battled and, and stumbled against Big K. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. So uh, uh, so so with that, that's been some time. Mm-hmm. He got it back together. Now he feel like he won't smoke. So now a uh, motivated Jay, different situation. I I who you got? Who you got? I got Jada Nightwing two one. Clear two might be a thirty. I'm gonna hold you. It's I, yeah, it's I, crazy I, I, level of talent right here. And it's a big stage. It's supposed to be a stage. Yeah, is it's it, supposed to be a stage. It's KG, be a KG, KG got them set up right. Yeah, it's gonna be Jay. And it's the West. Coast. It's yeah. a lot stacked against Tink. Tink, you gonna have to smoke something. Mm-hmm. Smoke something. Mm-hmm. Uh, Kid Chaos versus Emerson Kennedy. Mm. Uh, Emerson Kennedy is a dope lyricist. Uh. He's got some of my favorite bars. Some of my favorite bars from him was the him versus Jada Nightwing. Mm-hmm, 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 oh man, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I went through mountains and hundreds, and went a mountain to substance. I put it all on the counter. They used to call me counterproductive. That was good shit. Yes, so it, was. it was. That was fire. That was a recap that, was that we fire. did. We broke yeah, that down, didn't we? It was a while ago. That was fire. That was fire. Uh, 
fucking his battle on. He beat Chilla Jones. Mm -hmm. He beat Chilla. And I'm gonna miss everybody. Whoa, whoa. I'm not doing this. Not to mention, you know, the battle he had with T Top where he literally controlled everything because he blew the light. In fact, it was red and with all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And Kid yeah. Chaos battled. Stop playing. Kid Chaos battled Chilla Jones had mm -hmm. a different fate. Different? It did. It was. Now, that. We can, we can get into that. Okay, so the issue, the reason why I love this battle, this is my mm -hmm. personal, gonna be my personal battle of the night. This battle is for me. Right. The reason why this battle is for me is because it's gonna be a lot of nerd bars, flips. It's gonna be a lot of those, you gonna have to catch it a little bit later. Mm -hmm. I like that type of battle. There's gonna be references to movies and entertainment. Mm -hmm. This battle is going to have an entertainment factor, mm -hmm. but it's because of the fact that usually when they're battling somebody else, the other person's usually favored. Mm -hmm. So when it was Chess versus KK, I should favor Chess. When mm -hmm. it was Chess versus Shelly Jones, you favor Shelly Jones. Same thing when it came with Emerson Kennedy. Emerson Kennedy has only been the oh, yeah, okay. the anomaly mm -hmm. of some of the battles, but usually like him during the, uh during the um the Ultimate Madness tournament, he wasn't expecting him to do that good, but he didn't even last that. He was only in the second round. You get what I'm saying? For Emerson Kennedy, it's the likability or the uh, uh it's because of the flow. He gotta let everybody know mm -hmm. that I gotta give it a go. If it was a Ulster tag or John Stockton, you is it the way I gotta show you to give it a go? Mm -hmm. It's the but. Well, he can chaos do it. He can literally say the same thing. He said, I live the show. Give the flow. Whether it's Greg Austin tag or John Stockton. I give it go. It's the same thing, but it's how it's delivered. So, for me, this battle is 2-1 either way. Uh, yeah, uh, with Kid Chaos, he's very talented. I remember being put on to him a while ago, and when I first heard him, mm -hmm. I heard audio. I didn't even hear an actual... Like when Bill's body bag battle leaves, mm -hmm. Bill's mm -hmm. uh, works with URL. He had put me on the Kid Chaos. He said it was a kid named Kid Chaos, and he sent me some audio. Mm -hmm. And I heard him. It was that battle where he said, uh, you know, stomp the up jumps the, 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 the stomp the shit with Drew Hill. You know what I'm saying? Tell me what you want. Yeah, yeah. And I said, yo, who the fuck is this? You know what I'm saying? It's nice. Um, <laughs> leave in the trunk. Breathe in the trunk. Now get the up jump. The, tell me what you want. You know what I'm saying? And I said, yeah, he's very talented. Um, I do feel that sometimes some of his setups be way too long. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I feel like uh, if you're going to, and this is just my personal opinion, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Who the fuck am I? Nobody, right? Uh, you're in the right. I'm nobody. Yeah, I'm, I'm just a nigga with a camera. Yeah. So I just feel like sometimes, but he's shortened them in certain cir certain circumstances, mm -hmm. and I feel like Kid Chaos needs a clear win. Like he needs to win. Agreed. Uh, he needs to win a battle. You know what I'm saying? A clear win. Would, would bode well for him. Mm. Uh, since we're doing our, uh, you know what I'm saying, like certain MCs, you know what I'm saying, or certain situations where we think about it. Mm. Uh, Kid Chaos is very talented. You know, he's had some pins. Yeah. Uh, he's, he's battled, had a lot of he's pins. had a lot of pins. A lot you know of what I'm pins. saying? Like, he's battled JC, a lot. Chilla, uh, uh, Chess. He's got a lot of pins. Yeah, he's battled pins. Mm -hmm. Like, so it's uh, not. But what's he's got record? a pretty good record on the app, six and eight. You know what I'm saying? Okay, like, that's I, not bad. I, I honestly thought it was worse because I'm thinking of his last few battles because uh uh uh, uh Jay the Nightwing. Jay, uh, it was Jay. Uh, did he did he battle Danny? No. They say he battled Beat Out on Band. That was might have been like a, that one round of shit. He battled. Yeah, it was a one round. Band. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, he's got Saga on Born Legacy eleven. He, he that was a thirty. Saga. That was a thirty. Saga. Uh, Street Hems on Band, he beat Strange. That, that was that was the. Uh, yeah. He beat Danger Zone. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? He yeah. had JC. You know that what was saying? he, he had battled JC. I know that. Uh, he had Chilla Jones. Uh, he had Holmesy the God on Traffic. Mm -hmm. uh, Holmesy beat him. Holmesy beat him. Yes. Yeah, that's what, what, that's that's what I'm trying. I'm trying to think. Yeah, if yeah, I'm yeah. running down the line, Kid Chaos has kind of been losing. Cause with Chess it was a debatable loss. Mm -hmm. uh, with uh, with Holmesy that was a clear loss. Yeah, and then the beat out. Uh, and then beat out. Yeah, I mean, uh, the Chiller joint. Chiller just was levels the above, but it was the kid Capri's and you, shit. Yeah, like it. You know what I'm saying? So for for Kid Chaos, he gonna have to. He definitely gonna have to smoke Emerson Kennedy. Emerson Kennedy ain't the type to get smoked. Like mm -hmm. I said, it, unless he keeps doing the same flow. But Bro. sometimes it hit. Who you got winning though? I, it's either way for me. It's two one. I'm, I'm nope, nope. No, we'll do that. Uh, I got I, Chilla Jones versus Mike P. Uh, I got Chilla Jones winning. Period. On the you got side. Chilla Jones beating Mike P. Period. Easily. Yeah, easily. Just no problem. Just, Just not no, at all. Not at all. What you think? 
I mean, I was going to make the decision as well to say Chilla Jones, too, but you ain't had to make it sound so easy. I'm just saying, I feel like Mike going to have to smoke something. Mike going Mike to have to kill Chilla Jones. And, and, and it's not going to be cool if you kill Chilla Jones because, like, Chilla, he ain't the one you're supposed to have killed. Because every time every time you beat Chilla Jones, he in the lose-lose. Because every time they going to be like, oh, he smoked Chilla Jones. Yeah, but he should have said that shit to Geechee mm -hmm. in one round. He had to do it in three against Chilla. I know what they going to say, Mike. It don't matter. Mm -hmm. It don't matter. Go back to the way that you was doing it before. You ain't got to be the analytical. Stop being so analytical about yourself. Bring us back to the you can, how you can, how do can. Can't believe it. I need that, Mike, because mm -hmm. that is the way you can beat Chilla Jones. Mm -hmm. The way you can beat Chilla Jones is to outperform him. Mm -hmm. You can't outrap him. Mm -hmm. You won't be able to outwrap him. There's going to be so many schemes and so many things. Another thing that he's going to do, that Chilla Jones is going to do, Chilla Jones is going to angle. Of course, he's going to give us the Geechee angle. Mm -hmm. If he doesn't overdo it, he can easily, Chilla Jones can probably slide out of this. The mm -hmm. thing is, the eyes are on Mike P. They want to know what Mike P going to say. Is he going to take all of that out on Chilla Jones? The answer should be yes. Mm -hmm. The answer should be yes. Do not take this battle lightly. You're not battling Chilla Jones, Mike mm -hmm. P. You're not. Mm -hmm. Chilla Jones, you are there to collect that check. You're supposed to give him them bars and cook him and do exactly what you're supposed to do. This does nothing for you. This battle is more for Mike P. Uh, yeah, I, I'll get to that in a second. App stats, you got uh, Mike P 5 and 10 mm -hmm. on the app. Mm -hmm. uh, I had him edging Danny. Well, yeah, I had him winning against Danny. Hey. Uh, t t moving on from then, him and Real Sick, debatable. Mm -hmm. uh, I had Bill Collector winning. I had him beating Saga. Uh, him versus Lou, I had Lou Castro winning. Mm -hmm. Him versus Geechee. Uh, versus Lou Castro? Yeah, they battled before. I know they battled before. I'm trying to remember exactly how that went down. I had Lou Castro. Let's see what they would what my app say. Uh, yeah, the app has Lou Castro 800 to 400. I had Luke Castro win. So it was Luke Castro win. Um, in the app, the actual when you click in there, the, the first round they gave Mike with the edge. Luke Castro got the second. I, I, yeah, but that's right. just what, yeah. that's just what they say, not what I say. That's, yeah, I'm uh, trying to think. That's how I went uh, down. Uh, d -d 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 moving on, mm -hmm. uh, Geechee Gotti. We don't even need to talk about that. Um, <laughs> you had the Ryder battle. Even though he won, I had Ryder winning the battle in reality. I mean, he won with the judges, but okay. Uh, him <laughs> versus T Top, I had T Top winning too. So, I mean, it would be a good battle that he could potentially get some shit back in, but, uh... He's gonna have to kill Mike. He's gonna have to kill Chill. He's gonna have to kill him. Like, like, it has to be clear, no debate. But I got it, a clear, no debate going with Chilla Jones. Yeah, yep, um, I still got Chilla in this one. Two one. I, just, I just had to set the purpose. <laughs> Rum Nitty versus Danny Myers. What's up? Rum Nitty. 30. What? Oh no. Oh no. I said what I said. What? You standing on a 30? First of all, nobody got 30 in the first battle. And you think somebody got getting 30 in the second one around? Like Danny's gonna get 30 out there? Mind you, he had a battle with Clone that was coming that came up and he canceled it so he had more time to prepare. And he's got all his rounds ready. And you got him getting 30? Explain yourself. The, the, the floor is yours. When the last time you heard from Rum Nitty? It's been a minute. When the last Rum Nitty battle? I think it was Luke Castro. What happened in that battle? Or it might have been none none. The one round don't know. What happened in that he battle? Went crazy. He, he, I can't name a battle he don't go crazy. So. Rum Nitty sitting and stewing and just brooding on bars. On bars. It just sounds... It just sounds like it's about to be crazy. Yo, Not the to mention, Warriors are losing by 50, nigga. Whoa, how much? What? How much? Niggas is losing by 50. I had to stop. Keep going. So my bad. bad. My bad. bad. See, see, see. And you and you messed right, up my right, attitude. Right, right. Oh, back to my head. Hold on. Let me get back to Karen. Right. Six is lost by 35, but 50. That's even worse. Which is... But anyway, the reason why. I'm just sitting here thinking about that. And you mean to tell me, Rum Nitty just been sitting there just cooking, just mm -hmm. slow roasting these bars. Meanwhile, Danny been fast fooding McDonald's chicken filet of fish, whatever. 
that's been happening lately, stumbling and bumbling and battling your, your, your teammates, you're battling teammates again. I don't like none of this, Danny, and I feel as though that we have a respect level for each other that I could talk to you this way, and this is why I'm mad. Right. It was a classic the first time. Mm -hmm. Danny, do you think lightning can strike twice? Well, guy. Bar God, you're the one. You out here standing out here in the toga, looking like the uh, looking like the advertiser for the uh, for the uh, what's the what's the betting or the online betting? Oh, Caesars. Caesar's. Caesar's. Exactly. Yeah. Out here looking like a standing uh -huh. for Caesars. Stop it! Stop it, Danny. Uh -huh. You need. Danny ain't a uh, Rum Nitty ain't promoted. I ain't seen nothing on a timeline for Rum Nitty. This is spooky time. This is, other him, uh, now he be like, man, I was chilling with the kids and all that. Not to mention, he ain't mentioned about none of that bread that he spent. You don't, you don't use when people get a lot of money. You see it, you know, they got the chains, they got the cars, they got the watches, they get the stupid stuff. I ain't seen none of that. Mm -hmm. None of that. Rum Nitty's still hungry, man. Rum Nitty 30, man. 30? Uh, I think Danny Myers and Rum Nitty. Mm -hmm. They need to get the kids out the street. <laughs> get those kids out the street. It is adults about to play. I think that this battle right here lyrically could potentially be one of the biggest battles of the year, especially that it's not being live streamed. Uh, these guys are in for a fucking war. You know what I'm saying? Like, I think that it will be a war. I think lyrically, you know, Danny Myers, his pen, you know, he's probably not going to try to punch, punch, punch. With the best, his best route would probably be the route that he took in the first battle, which is not to try to punch with Nitty. Because if you try to outpunch him or punch with him, he's gonna he's gonna clear the haymaker you coming around the corner. It's, right, it's coming. So if you lyrically, you know, jump in between those rounds and you battle him, you know what I'm saying, like with actual material bars and things like that. Uh, I definitely got this battle going two one. Uh, I'm stuck. I go Danny one day. I go Nitty the next day. Danny one day. Yeah, next day. Uh, this nigga got it at 30. 30. So we're going to just play it out on your behalf. You know what I'm saying? I got the 2-1. You know what I'm saying? You got the 30. I got the 2-1. Overall, scale of 1 to 10. I only rate this card about a 6.5 or a 7. I'm going to go with a 7 just for the, for the sake of it. Uh, the bottom of the card is it's a little light. You know what I'm saying? Like, like the bottom three, four battles are mm -hmm. a little light. I'm not going to hold it. But overall, I'm good with Danny and Romney, though. I'm only... Two things that I'm mad at. The reason, uh, and, I, and I'm gonna keep that rating at the six and a half. Mm -hmm. One of the reasons is because y'all could have took a chance to put this on caffeine because this is another situation where we're now gonna have to wait for another card to drop on the app. Right. And civil war has happened last week, and we still waiting on the day two battles mm -hmm. from Kings versus Queens. Right. So like we about to be more backed up than cheese, potatoes, and all mm -hmm. of that protein, and you just sitting on a plane for ten hours. It's gonna be a lot. <laughs> it's gonna be a lot. You gonna have to flush out. Right. That, so that's the reason why I'm not mad at the bottom of the card because at least I know everybody name. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna. Be, I'm gonna, and the whole. Not to mention, wasn't there a whole ladies card that Friday mm -hmm. that happened? Like those are supposed to come out too. We're not gonna see live and die in L.A. until we die in L.A. It's gonna. It's yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh God, it'll be a month of moon. <laughs> come on, man. Like I'm just saying. But it is what it is. Unless you're in the area. Looking forward to seeing it. You already know what to do.